Good morning and happy Saturday. I am on my way to the Science Center with the neighbors. So, uh, come on, let's go. We're having like a Mustang show on the corner here. It's pretty exciting. Oh, that one's a police? Yeah. Allowed to do that? Maybe is it a real police car? A police? Oh, that's crazy. Here is the Tegu. And this is kind of, I guess this reptile can be kind of like a that's dog. Scary. That's scary. It's scary. No, look oh, how nice he's he is. He's, he's just cute. sleeping. Wow. He's just trying to get comfortable. Wait, stop. Okay, so we're at the Science Center and we're in the um, nature works area where they have all the reptiles. And this one here is called a Surinam toad. And their babies hatch out of their back. They, they form little pouches on their back. It is breathing. I just saw it breathe. Oh my gosh. It's so strange though. Like, And look, they're very flat. They look like they've been run over. But, they, but I just can't believe their babies hatch out of their back. So strange. And here's another one. This is the budget frog, budget frog. This one, when it's feeling, um, when it's disturbed or uh, anything like that, it lets out a piercing shriek. Isn't that nuts? Okay, so this next one is the Mata Mata turtle. And we were looking at it and we didn't even realize this is the turtle. <laughs> Isn't that nuts? Look at his little nose. Chin. That's wow. not a little nose. <laughs> it says that they open their mouth as wide as possible and they create a low pressure vacuum. They literally suck their prey out whole. That's uh, it's pretty nuts. This is an Asian vine snake. Look how pretty it is. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love the color. This turtle is so cool looking. Check it out. It's like black with little white polka dots. It's very fashionable. So this is this is the scariest sign in the whole place. Where did he? Where is he? This is a. It's a non. I'm sorry. It's an eastern indigo snake, and it's non-venomous. Look how pretty it is. So shiny. And they even have a little like water play area in Kids Town, and a water table. Look at that. So you can you can make your own boat trail. Oh my gosh, this dinosaur is totally alive. Do, do you guys realize that this thing is alive? This is a huge liability. Oh, you push a button. Grown Tyrannosaurus weighs about 14,000 pounds. Oh my gosh. Will you push one of them? Oh. Is that not scary? That's pretty awesome. Oh my gosh. Look at his tail. Whoa. That's pretty crazy looking. I love the little tiny hands. Look at those little arms. Oh no, he didn't like that I was talking about his little arms. Oh. He kind of looks like he's doing the robot, or like the Macarena. I don't know, I can't tell. Whoa. I didn't know this, but the word dinosaur means terrible lizard. Did you guys know that? Yeah. Did you know that the Tyrannosaurus has more room in its brain for smelling than for thinking? That's nuts. So this is pretty cool. It's called Jurassic Ridge, and it's basically just like a dig site. We were trying to dig up the, um, whatever this is. We don't know what it is yet. What do you think it is? <laughs> and they give you like all these fun little, the tiniest paintbrushes ever. <laughs> oh. I think I found something. What do you think it is? I don't know. Oh. So we're looking at this um, polarioscope thing. Can you see this? Doesn't that look like a toenail? Like somebody put their toenail in there? <laughs> that's pretty, that's pretty gross. Big news in Orlando. Snow. I have a video on the science atmosphere. So if you guys are interested in learning about those planets a little bit more and seeing some cool images, we're going to start making laughing. It's snow. In Orlando. In Orlando. <laughs> He's in there, he's in there. It's like the big hamster wheel, I'm gonna do it next. There it is, oh my gosh, this is so cool. So he's actually on Mars right now and all of the images that they got for this um, program is from Curiosity. That's awesome. Jen is getting her slippers on. <laughs> And then I'm sure you know about the buttons that you're not yeah. surprised. Look how fancy she looks. <laughs> this is so cool. They're making like little kinetic sculptures. So this is one of the little sculptures that they made. And you can spin the little the little thing here and then it turns all your little gears 
That's awesome. So we ended up going to Hawkers and here is the aftermath of all of the food that we got. So much food. If you guys haven't been here, you definitely need to try it. It's delicious. Okay, so I'm finally back home and I put the video up. Um, I uploaded it this morning, but I forgot to actually put it public for you guys. So it's up now. And then we are gonna go to Aubrey's christening in like an hour and a half. So Tim should be home soon from work. We're gonna go to church. The christening is at the end of mass and then dinner, I think. I'm so excited to give Aubrey her new clothes. A lot of you guys yesterday said that good christening gifts were things like a christening blanket or a personalized Bible and things like that. And unfortunately we just didn't have enough time to get her like a really nice personalized gift. So I just got some little um, cute clothes that I saw at Target and then we'll probably get her a more um, meaningful gift <laughs> later on. But um, I'm excited to go to her christening though. I think it'll be really cool. We're letting the dogs out after dinner and look what's in the pool. It's, it's one of those big looking. ones. It's one of those crazy big grasshoppers. You ready? Are you gonna touch it? Yeah. In your nice church clothes? In my nice church clothes. Is he gonna jump away? Maybe, I don't know. There's like a wasp right next to us here. I know, I see that. Jump away now. Jump. Jump away. All right, he's, he lives here now. Oh no. Okay, go. Go. Look how cool he is. Oh my gosh, he's like so neat. Look at his little butt keeps flicking up. I think that's where he breathes from. From his butt? Yeah. Why do you think that? I, 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 don't oh. jump this way. All right, there we go. <laughs> he's, he's making too much of a move towards my face. <laughs> By the way, look at what I came home to. Uh, I already ate three of them. Oh no, and Jen ate one too. Look at that, we're already halfway through. Never any good at fractions, by the way. We're all done with the baptism. Baby's baptized. Yay, we're over here at Bonefish now for the after baptism supper. Jen and I just got a reservation for 10 because we like big tables. I need Not, lots of space yeah. for activities. I mean, we have to like put our food over there and like reach across and eat it. That's how we do it. Look, I gave you a turtle, Aubrey. There it is. Some bang bang shrimp. I don't like seafood. Well, let's try it. Let's see. It's pretty spicy. I don't mind shrimp, actually. Okay, good. It was like fried shrimp, I think, only. Fried shrimp only. Fried shrimp only. <laughs> you will cherish that turtle for the rest of your life. This is the filet and zucchini and potatoes are gratin. Oh, looks good. That burger with some french fries, looking good. We got Jen's Whoa. Jamaican coconut oh my God. rum pie. This thing's like super rum pie. Yeah. This is like, they just poured rum on the plate. Rummy rum rum. Finally back home. Man, what a long day that was. Sorry it was a little bit crazy and disconnected with Jen going to the science center and then going out to Hawkers and then I come in and we're like, let's go do baby baptism stuff and then we eat at Fish Bones. Although, Fish Bones was very delicious, but now I am ridiculously tired, so I'm gonna go to bed, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Now it's time to pay the price.